and Bob Tway's son, <laughs> Kevin Tway, is your winner. That's up at Silverado. Uh, so that's it for me for now, but I'll be back at 1130 for Sports Wrap with Scott Reese. Now it's time for the 11 o'clock news. Take I, it away. Lo I love the celebration dancing. I know. That was good. <laughs> Looking good. Jason, thank you. Yeah. Coming up next at 11. An emotional ceremony in the North Bay, remembering the lives and homes lost one year ago in devastating wildfires. I didn't expect to be this emotional on the anniversary. I knew it would bring up some emotions. But... The 11 o'clock news on KTVU Fox 2 starts now. Friends, family, and community members gathered in Sonoma County tonight, hours before the moment one year ago when the Tubbs fire broke out. Hello again, I'm Aliana Gomez. And I'm Frank Somerville. The Tubbs fire destroyed thousands of homes, leaving many people with nothing. But tonight, survivors and loved ones gathered to share their stories. KTV's Andre Sr. is at Sonoma City Hall tonight. Andre, it was very emotional. Very emotional indeed, Frank. For those who know this area, know that it's a small, tight-knit community. And for that reason, even if you didn't lose anything, you probably know someone who lost their home. And we can tell you tonight that many people gathered here in front of this area. They were very emotional during this event.